birthdays this week, we've got TJ Foss, Justin Udy, um, Andrew Stemmen, Corbin Watson, and Corbin Branham. And that's a close. Today's week's announcements, uh, we're going to have a camp food job the 9th through the 13th. Uh, bring camps to your 4th period class, you will receive Beta and Stuco points. The 4th period that has the most camps will receive a pizza party. Uh, one act meeting Wednesday, November the 4th, dinner and breakfast, and auditions will be November 9th after school. And that's all the announcements. Hopefully have a wonderful week, and peace out. I finally got his job. My man's gone to COVID, so I'm going to be your mother man finally. I know y'all been wanting to have a crossover, but it's not going to happen. I'm taking over this weather channel now. Monday is going to be a high of 76 with a low of 63, partly cloudy. Tuesday is going to be a high of 74 and a low of 46 with a 40% chance of rain. Wednesday is going to be a high of 68, a low of 47, and it's going to be clear, clear skies and sunny. Thursday it's going to be 72 for the high. 52 for the low, and then on Friday it's going to be a high of 66 and a low of 50. Uh, it's going to be partly cloudy. And that's it for your weather channel. Back to the relaxed Sports Central. Ladies and gentlemen, football is over. Dun dun dun. I know it's sad moments. And volleyball is over. Dun dun dun. Even sadder. But congratulations, girls, uh, on going on having the by district win and going two rounds into the playoffs. Woo! In other words, boys basketball, we ain't got no news on that because uh, football is still going on. Well, it was last week, and uh, still don't have any news on that. But girls, though, on the other hand, they're going up against Detroit at Detroit on Tuesday, and then on Saturday, they're going to be going up against Dodd City at home, our own Patriot Stadium. Uh, we don't have the times yet, or official timestamps. Just keep y'all's eyes, ears, and open for that, and that's it for your news.